गुड मॉर्निंग क्लास फोर आई होप यू आर सेफ एट होम चिल्ड्रन टूडे वील स्टार्ट विद चैप्टर नंबर थ्री दैट इज टूल्स ऑफ वर्ड प्रोसेसर एज यू हैव ऑलरेडी स्टार्टिड इन योर प्रीवियस क्लास अ वर्ड प्रोसेसर हेल्प्स अस इन क्रिएटिंग एंड एडिटिंग द डॉक्यूमेंट एंड ऑल्सो सेविंग इट फॉर फ्यूचर यूज टूडे वी लर्न मोर अबाउट द टूल्स introduction to editing feature what is editing children editing is the process of making desired changes in the document as per the requirement or need if you are doing certain things then you are said to be doing the editing in the word document for example if you are inserting a new text you are doing the editing if you are deleting some text then you are doing the editing if you are moving text from one place to another or from its original place to some new place that is cut paste control plus x is the shortcut key for that next is duplicating the text duplicating means to making a or creating a copy of the text copy we'll do with the help of shortcut key control plus c ye we have done this in the previous class Next is replacing the old text with a new one. We can even change the text from the old text to the new text. Undo and redo tool. Undo tool helps you to reverse the accidental or last action. The shortcut key for undo is Control plus Z. Its icon is also present on the quick access toolbar. so we can use the menu also next is your redo tool redo tool redoes redoes means like something like repeat redoes an action that has been undone okay if you have undone something that is undo something then if again you want to do it that no i don't want to undone it then in that case you'll use this redo option to undone it the shortcut key for redo is ctrl or control plus y sometimes when redo tool has nothing to redo then in that case it changes itself into repeat command okay checking spelling and grammar tool children spelling and grammar tool highlights the misspelled and grammatically incorrect text and it also provides a list to replace the incorrect text okay this tool uses the following color indicators to mark the errors sometimes you have seen some wavy lines or the zigzag lines that appear below some word which is maybe misspelled or grammatically incorrect or maybe having a different meaning so that is what the spelling and grammar tool does for example here you can see a b d is underlined with red color that is the red wavy line represents the misspelled words similarly the green wavy lines are used for representing the grammatical errors that you have done in your document and similarly blue wavy lines are used for representing the contextual errors all right auto correct feature auto correct feature corrects the usual spelling mistakes like capitalization errors and misspelled words that is whose spelling is not correct as the name suggest auto correct feature means automatically correcting something okay so this feature was first launched in year 1993 For example, you can see here the red underlined word that is its spelling is b u w s i n e w s which is wrong. So the computer will automatically correct it to the new spelling which is shown by the arrow that is b u s i n e w s. Okay. Next tool is thesaurus tool. The thesaurus tool in MS Word helps you. in looking up the synonyms that is similar and antonyms that means opposite of a word that we will select okay so thesaurus option is present in the proofing group on the review tab 
as you can see in the image also review tab is opened inside it you have the proofing group within that group you can see this option thesaurus next is find and replace tool the find and replace are two useful tools in ms word with the help of which we can find and replace the text with some replacement within seconds that is without wasting any time okay and the shortcut key which we can use for it is control plus h now if you find the text that you want to replace first you have to go to the menu like click on the home tab then editing group and then find option next if you want to replace the text then again you have to go through the menu like click on the home tab then editing group and then the replace option okay okay children now you will read the chapter thoroughly thank you class